Your Majesty, Mrs. Manzini SD, obesity, translucence, and also in a glass nose of transparency. Let me untangle the knot and putting my two legs astride on Asana. But before I put them astride on Asana, let me straddle my saddle and turn me loose and furthermore let me wander over yonder on my own to my own. I know it will be very much indelicate of me if I don't pass my profound felicitations because I am exultant and I am also ebullient by the 2022 grade 12 learners who were our cream de la cream like ourselves this year 2023. Furthermore, let me introduce and acknowledge and appreciate the persona and personhood. Let me appreciate and acknowledge the personhood and humanhood. Let me acknowledge the humanhood and personality and persona non grantas which are unavailable because of the availability of the unavailability of the space. <laughs> Allow me to introduce and acknowledge the following in the interest of time. Our lovely and beautiful second manager who is in our presence today, sitting there with me. Second manager, may you take a bow. I know they will see you. Let me also acknowledge our second staff who are always hands on. Our second staff, may you take a bow wherever you are. Let me also appreciate the creativity and the creation created by the Almighty God. Those who are here with us today, our pastors, those who make things possible for us, even if we don't pray, I know that someone elsewhere is busy saying the Bongo second should prosper. Somebody elsewhere is busy saying that Charlotte Doreen Manzini and Ngetenge Case Coven and their principals should soldier on and make it possible for us to see the end of the tunnel. But among other things, or among other personalities, let me single out some of them. Advocate Reverend Nyambi of the Evangelical Presbyterian Church of South Africa. Your presence, my advocate, is highly acknowledged. You may take a bow. <laughs> Let me also acknowledge Dr. Helen Baloi, who is my mother by choice, who is my biological mother by choice and a former colleague, I know she cannot be able to stand so that you can see her, but she's here with us. Thanks, doctor, thanks, my mom. We also have my mom once more, my colleague, ma'am Shipalana. May you also take a bow so that these lovely, beautiful souls, they can see you. We also have people you love to hate. That is an oxymoron. People you love to hate. Our principals of both private, independent, public and ordinary schools, both secondary and primary schools. May you take a bow wherever you are, colleagues. Thank you very much. Now, the last group, but not least, before I say the deed is done, we have got learners yourselves, grade 12 learners, who are no longer grade 12 learners, 
who are first year students in various institutions of higher learning seated here with us. Before I say a lot about you, please write down the following. You are here to learn. Number one. Number one. Number one, I know you are still taking your books. The best way to encourage yourself is to encourage somebody else. Full stop. The best way to encourage yourself is to encourage somebody else. Full stop. The best way to encourage you is to encourage me. Number two, most of the people we face every day are negative, including myself. Most of the people we face every day are negative, and not everybody is for you. We cannot be with you forever. Not everyone is for you. Number three, let me repeat the second one. Most of the people we face every day are negative and not everyone is for you to hard to believe number three the choice is simple full stop the choice is simple you can either stand up and count or lie down and be counted out I repeat number three. The choice is simple. You can either stand up and count or lie down and be counted out. Number four. I repeat number three. The choice is simple. You can either stand up and count or lie down and be counted out. Number four. The most important person you talk to, the most important person you talk to all day is you. So be careful what you say to you. I repeat this one, it's most important. The most important person you talk to all day is you. So be careful what you say to you. In other words, if you say negative things about yourself, really those negative things are going to happen. Number five, no one can defeat you unless you first defeat yourself. Nobody can defeat you unless you first defeat yourself. The last but one, ora et labora. Ora, O-R-A, ora. Ora et labora, O-R-A. One word, at it, one word, ora et labora, and brackets, pray and work. Prayer without work or hard work is superstition. Even if we can pray in tongues, even if we can say, karamashana, karamashana, oh, karabo, karabo, nothing, there is no miracle in the person paper. The last. Aide, A I D E, Aide. A I D E, Aide. One word. The second word is toit. T O I T. Aide, toit. Another word. Lyset, Aidera Terra. Aide, toit, Aiset, Lydera Terra. Meaning, God help those who help themselves. God help those who help themselves. And the very last, my beautiful boys and girls, all of you sitting here, and all of us, going forward, may your presence be punctuated with the reluctance whose magniloquence can only be theatropistically exacerbated by the reminiscent, by the reminiscent use of the language. And I know you might not be able to engulf this pedagogic and heterogeneous conversationism. 
and I hope you don't mind my apostasy and you don't mind my linguistic approach because Shitonga and English are compulsory in our schools, including Sipeli. And Shitonga will say, Mita Yosaseka Aina Mwini, Ndielo Yosaseka Aideli. I rest my case, case being my name.